Garissa County is facing a terrible drought situation and the county is at an alarming stage as livelihoods suffer due to lack of food. Garissa Governor Nadif Jama is working with the national government and other development partners to see how the county can mitigate the effects of drought by distributing relief food and clean water to the residents. We hope to see uh, more support from the national government uh, sooner than later. Uh, we hope to see much more um, activities being undertaken by uh, the, the development partners and agencies. And for that matter, as a county government, in addition to whatever we are doing, we will also enhance our support. In fact, I have just committed, despite the current situation that we are in, whereby we are passing through a, um, a period of transition as a county government. The county boss further committed to immediately release 40 million shillings to buy water and food for the affected households and school-going children. Governor Jama has raised concerns that many children in the county may miss the national examination, which has set for 28th November due to hunger. But we have, have just committed to 40 million shillings um, to immediately uh, from our uh, uh, little resources uh, so that we buy water uh, and food for our people immediately. Uh, and for that matter, also, hopefully food for, particularly food for the uh, school children. My biggest worry is that the exams are coming and that um, if we do not do uh, those immediate interventions, my fear is that we'll miss, we'll have a lot of our children missing in school and for that matter missing the exams. Garissa County Commissioner Boaz Chirutich on his part said small subsector teams tasked with finding solutions for different issues will table the report for approval and for budgetary allocation. We have identified a technical team uh, headed by sector heads who will go and uh, work out on those budgetary issues. Uh, a report will be prepared to be approved by uh, the co-chairs of the, the, the county steering group after which it will be forwarded to Nairobi for funding. We want to appeal to all our development partners, the donors and the agencies working in the county to double, double up their efforts. We really appreciate the work they are doing. Uh, we have also stressed the issue of duplication and therefore uh, we have uh, agreed that uh, a small team will sit to look at those issues so that a report can be tabled before, uh, before the governor. Garissa County government has identified the gaps that require immediate attention and it has formed technical teams headed by sector heads to look into those issues and bring a report to be forwarded for action. Kind of Stefano, Ebre TV.